today we're going to be focusing heavy on squats, one of the main core exercises that there is. Uh, squats help you so much, they help build your natural testosterone, you can get so many parts of your body right here, you'll mess around and see increases from your upper body from doing squats. So squats are one of the main things we do here. We did 10 sets of squats. Um, such an important exercise, we had to do 10 whole sets of it. We're not just going to come in and take the fundamental exercise of leg day, which is squatting, and do three or four or five sets. We did 10 sets. One thing I want you guys at home to remember is the weights that we use are not the weights that you're going to use. You use the weights that you're comfortable with. Your one rep max is different from mine. Mine is different from his. So you don't have to look at us and say, oh, well, you're doing this. Use your one rep max and apply it to your workout, but do what we did using your weights. Anytime you do an 80% of your max or higher, you can get that two to two and a half minutes of rest. Just so you can have a full recovery for maximum power output. So I'm working to build that one rep max. You know, if y'all want to be fully recovered, so I can give, I'm gonna give it 100% effort, but I want 100% you know, the maximum output as well. So I'll give myself between two. Two to two and a half, and I'm going like 90%, sometimes three, but no more than three. You don't want to get too much rest, just enough to be able to still put the heavy weight on there and get it up. Squats is about just being mentally tough. Everybody can do them, but you know, so now everybody's willing to get up under that, get up under that bar, put some heavy weight and squat deep. So, you know what I'm saying? This is just a way to, to build that mental toughness up. So, when we start um, our next you know what I'm saying? When we start our next day of squats, you know what I'm saying? We already have a stronger mental capacity. 320 pounds. Three reps. Right here. My man, you looked at one of our introductory videos last week. 355. Took him out. Now he about to show you this progression. This man was maybe about a month ago. He about to dog at 355 now. 355, easy breath, let's get it. Maybe a little bit more than my one rep max. I'm about to dog for two of them. We started with 80% uh, of our one rep max, five, three sets, five reps. Went up to about 85%, one set, three reps, 90%, one set, two reps. But for him, it was a little bit different. He did 355 for four reps. Now, that's not 90% of his one rep max, but um, last time he did 355, he couldn't even complete one set. I mean, one rep. This time he got four, so that was good for him. Uh, he, he been progressing. And so then we jumped to pause squats, pause reps, so about two, three second pauses, four sets, five reps, with 75% uh, of our one rep max. For example, mine was about, uh, I think, 285. He was about 275. 275. And then we went, um, we finished out with a burnout set with a 220, I did 225, he did 205, 20 to 30 reps. Um, that right there is just for mental toughness. You know once, you, once you get to the point of doing nine reps already, nine sets, excuse me, already, and you've gone up to close to your one rep max, those burnouts are torture on your body. You know what I mean? You might be able to start off fresh and get over 20 easy at 205, 225. But once you get to your 10th set, man, your legs will be burning up. You'll really get that good work in. It's all about improving yourself, getting better each day, each workout. You know what I mean? Like I said, you go to the gym or Instagram, working out is two hours out of your day. You gotta go hard, 10 sets of squats. And that's just squatting. We still got the rest of the legs to do today, but we wanted to give y'all squats and how gym wreckage believes squats should be done. It's the fundamental exercise. 
Let's make it fundamental by doing it a lot of times. 10 sets of squats. Don't cheat yourself with the squats. Uh, it should always be a challenging day when you're doing uh, squats. I mean, if you ain't tired, if you ain't breathing hard, if you ain't sweating, um, I don't believe you really were accomplished that day only because squats is an exercise to where, you know, even giving minimum effort, you will still be kind of tired just because it's such a taxing uh, workout on the body. So don't cheat yourself when you come here. Make sure you're getting deep. Make sure you keep your form right. Um, don't just go ham when the camera on you. You know what I'm saying? Do it when ain't nobody looking as well. So, you know what I'm saying? Once you get out in that public eye, they'll see you've been working because your uh, results will show for itself. You against you. You're your biggest competition. Let's get it. Don't try, to be no, don't try to be nobody else. You know what I'm saying? My heavy ain't your heavy. I might hit 405, my one rep max, yours might be 135. That's fine. If it's heavy to you, you go progress. You go get better. So do your weight. Don't try to ego go heavier. You hurt yourself. Do your weight. Make sure your form, your <laughs> technique is right. Give 100% intensity. Hey, man. The best type of wreckage there is. Gym, Gym wreckage. wreckage.